Kevin Ranahan. Ah, <laughs> Kevin Ranahan. Uh, I'd have to say Kevin is probably one of the funniest people I've ever met. He's got a very dry, kind of a subtle sense of humor. It's not like he's a joke teller or anything like that. He's just, he, he reacts to situations that he's really, and a tremendous fireman, tremendous fireman. Really good to have on your group, good to work with all around. Good guy. All right, so um, what was it like tillering? You know what it's like tillering? It's better than any ride they ever had at Disney or will ever have at Disney. Nothing else, you know? And to be up there, so it, when you first start to till, they don't just say, all right, jump up, you're gonna till it to this fire. They'd have your tiller on the run, on the ride back. So you'd go on a run somewhere and the boss would say, all right, jump up and till it back. And naturally you're shitting your pants because whoever did that before? So we get, I get up there and I had a, they'd say, a oh, guy, I'll teach you what to do. And I had some great guys teaching me how to tiller and I thought I got pretty proficient at it. But they'd send a couple of spare pieces in once in a while. And I was on, I was fortunate enough to tiller an open piece. So tiller an open, there's no, nothing around you. You're just out there. And the first time we got this piece, they said, all right, Ricky Quinlan was the boss. Jump up and tiller. I, okay, I'll jump up and tiller. And I get up there and I looked at the tiller wheel and saw that it was connected with a bent nail. And I was like, that's what's holding this friggin' stand wheel, tiller wheel in, is a fucking bent nail. So we go on a run and I'm watching the nail because I don't want this thing to fall out, you know? Anyhow, we go, one of the first times we get this open piece, we get a run up on Parker Hill, big hill, and Mandy Lee's driving, I'm tillering. And I had been tillering for quite a while, so I was comfortable. But with this open piece, it was different. So. We're on the hill, he stops. It was a five-speed standard truck. I don't think he drove a standard that much. So we stopped for a minute, and then we are gonna move up to the fire building, and that piece started bouncing. And the two of them are in the front seat bouncing because he let the clutch out too soon. And I'm looking at this hill behind me saying, I'm diving out of this fucking thing. The first, once it starts going backwards, I'm not waiting for it to pick up steam. I'm out of here. So I, I was hanging on, yeah, and I'm gonna say I'm taking a dive here. But luckily, he was able to get it forward and I didn't have to jump out. But Tiller and something like, even to this day, uh, I, I filmed, I actually f did some film of uh, a run and I sat up in the Tiller seat. and I dig through my house all the time looking for that because it was like, it was. We had an old Maxim. The old Maxim trucks were so loud that you could hear them coming three blocks away. So it was like driving a funny car or something. You know, it was so loud and you're up there and everyone's staring at you. Little kids are pointing at you and shit. Yeah, beat that.